All right, hey guys, welcome back. Sam Terrell, the Northwest Aeronaut. We just departed runway 02 here at Twin Oaks, and today we are talking about forward slips to landing. There is uh, some misconception out there about forward slips, and oftentimes you'll see folks uh, coming high on final, which is fine. And then what they'll do is they'll put in that aileron and they'll put in that full rudder, and I'm going to turn cross one real quick. Twin Oaks traffic, uh, 7 8 alpha left cross one, 02, Twin Oaks. They'll put in that aileron, they'll put in that rudder, and they will just dive the nose down at the ground. Which, uh, I gotta tell you folks, is kind of defeating the purpose. So it's a little counterintuitive, but in fact, if you want to get down fast, pitching up for a slower airspeed is going to be much more effective than pitching nose straight down. Because when you pitch straight down, Turn up traffic, 7 make off a left downwind, 0 2 turn up. When you pitch straight down, all you do is gain a bunch of airspeed. And then, if you're doing that with a slip, as soon as you take the slip out, you've got tons of extra airspeed and you are shooting halfway down that runway. So what we're going to do is we're going to come in a little bit high, but then we're going to pitch for our approach speed, which is 60. And wherever the nose is when we're pitched for 60, that is what... The, that's the pitch attitude we are going to maintain while we put the slip in. And you might see the airspeed fluctuate a bit because we, when we put the slip in, we are taking the pitot tube out of the direct um, airstream. So it might read lower than what it actually is. And when you bring this, take the slip out, you'll see the airspeed shoot up. And that's why it's so important to keep the airspeed under control uh, when you're doing these slips and just establish a proper pitch attitude for the approach. I'm going to turn base here. You know, traffic RV3 and 7 Victor Alpha, left base, 0 2, one up. Establish a proper pitch attitude for the approach, and then hold that pitch attitude as you put the slip in. We're not going to be diving down uh, with the slip in there. We're just going to hold that pitch attitude, put the slip in, and bring it down. All right, we are pretty high here on base. We are going to get half flaps in. Actually, we're just going to go full flaps right now. Turn and final. Turn off traffic, RV3 and 7 Victor Alpha, final, 0 2, Twin Oaks. And we're going to get down to our approach speed, which is 60. We're going to pitch and trim for 60. And then we're going to use a bit of a slip here to lose all this altitude. All right, so there's 60. I'm going to do left aileron and right rudder, and I'm going to keep the pitch of my nose right where it is. And it is going to come down very nicely. Now, I want you to see, my airspeed right now is reading 55, 54. When I take the slip out, watch. Watch that airspeed shoot up back to 60. You see that? I put the slip in, and it goes down. I take the slip out, it goes up. So we're just holding it here. I'm holding full right rudder, and I'm just using just enough aileron to keep my track straight down the center line. Once I get down to a reasonable altitude, an appropriate altitude for the approach, I'll take the slip out and continue like normal. All right, here we go. We're coming down. We're getting to a good altitude. I'm going to take that slip out, and I'm going to add just a tad of power, maintaining 60. We don't want to speed up. To get it coordinated here. There we go. And again, the second stripe is where we're setting this down. I'm pitching for 60. You got to put nose down just a tad, just a tad of power, letting it come in straight towards those numbers before I take the power out. I open my eyes up to the whole horizon. I take that breath in with my eyes, and I'm not letting it land. I'm just flying it. I'm flying it all the way down. I'm flying it. 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 I'm flying it until those wheels just set down and I maintain that center line. All right. We'll go ahead and get off here at the high-speed taxiway. Perfect. Hey, guys. Thank you very much for joining me here. Uh, I hope that was helpful. I want to thank Mike for being my cameraman here on the ground. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button so you don't miss my future videos. And uh, until next time, resume your own navigation. We'll see you then.